just months after opening up her fourth restaurant in L.A., Lisa Vanderpump is now weeks away from opening a new lounge in Las Vegas. In six weeks, I shouldn't even really be sitting here. But <laughs> why? it was such a great opportunity. Yeah, why Vegas? Well, because when they ask you if you want to be in Vegas, that's like the ultimate compliment. So I wasn't going to turn that down. They wanted to open a cocktail garden, and I think they saw the brilliant design, you know, of Tom Tom, and they wanted something just totally fabulous. So they offered it to me, and I said yes. Is there any possibility that we could get a Vanderpump Rules Vegas following the staff of that Ooh, location? Lordy, that would be like a hot mess traveling. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe. I mean, I'm sure some of them might want to work out there. So if we get picked up for another series, I'm sure some of it will filter over there. I'm not sure. Well, Sheena has said that she would be willing to work at that place. So. Oh, I haven't offered her a job yet. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, she would be good because she knows kind of how I do things. So well she's worked with me for so many years so maybe yeah she could go over there she's got a show that she loves doing over there yeah. as well so yeah maybe he's done a lot better but like sometimes if we ever have to bring up our past he's like super shut off about it you're telling her basically shut up i don't want to talk about it okay this season of vanderpump rules yes i'm not going to apologize it's another <laughs> wild great season yeah, it is, yeah jackson Brittany, we saw their proposal we'll get yeah. to see their engagement party yeah. later this season and then wedding next season yes. do you see this as a long-lasting relationship look we know jack's history and normally the best indication of a future behavior is past behavior unless something really triggers a, a huge change and i think grief and losing someone can do that and i think the significant loss that he endured with losing his father look i don't know i can't predict the future but right now he seems to be on track so hopefully let's keep our fingers crossed and they'll keep their legs crossed <laughs> like say, okay. you've seen the change in him i have i have i think he's quite committed to her i really do she's a fabulous girl she never has like a mean bone in her body unless jax is on top of that <laughs> You have to cut that out. No, we are leaving that in. <laughs> and then we have James. James. He's your ex-husband. He's my father. You can't talk to me about dad. Was I a mother? You took your first steps at f***ing Tiffany's. And he does have a good side. And I really want to show that. As an executive producer on that show, it's been very important to me that we always, you know, show the true story. But that side of him, where he's supporting his family, the way his family have struggled, I mean, that's a, a lot of responsibility for a young man. And he really, he has stepped up to it. So hopefully he will grow up. Does he grow up this season or will that be seasons to You've come? You've got to watch. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to watch. Just keep watching. We still have a lot of Vanderpump season left to watch. Yes. How would you describe what is still to come? Well, there's definitely some surprising moments that even I say, oh, they did not do that. Yes, they did. <laughs> oh, God. But it's always been like that. It's kind of show you could actually film 24, you know, 7, because it's not just like a cast that get together to film. Right. They're always together and they're always, you know, they have good times, but they misbehave. I don't show the best moments. We definitely show their worst. <laughs> okay. Oh, my God. Here's oh, the... my Jesus God. Here we go. That was so trashy. Band of Pump Rules is America's perfect reality show.